all right now we want to um create the advert itself we've created the page and we've put together the graph the graphics that we want to use and if you just create the page we've also even updated the page by um posting something uh, posting our adverts posting information about the product that we are selling what is next if we just leave it that way for only our friends to see or those that have visited our page to see we may not go so far especially if we don't have a lot of um followers on our page or maybe if you have up to 10 million followers on your page or maybe um 5 million or uh, thereabouts on your page it is possible that you may not even need an advert and yet your promotion will get to so many persons uh, but this time assuming is just a new page that is created of course it will always be a new page if you're creating a page for any products that you are um you're selling it will be a new page uh, you now say that uh, it will not sell or you will not sell unless you advertise the page not just the page the products on the page no, not advertising the page but the product itself that you posted on the page yesterday we created the page stylish marble phone marble iphone case um and uh, it's 17 hours since the creation of the page, the page and the products rather since we put this product up it's 17 hours but how many persons has it got to only two persons two people reached for 17 hours and of the two persons reached what is the engagement zero engagement uh, you see the thing so th that is why it is necessary to boost this the purpose of boosting is to reach much much more persons that we buy from you or that we likely buy and when you boost you see that a uh, you're giving the opportunity to target people that are likely to buy the product so what do we do let us now begin the process of boosting you come here and click boost your post to reach more people all right so here you this is a the panel per se or the dashboard where you are boosting so welcome back to boost. boost this product with your default settings or edit your selections you just have to edit everything we are is a new boosting altogether mm. so see they have also the audience the audience are the people that you want to see the product so you have a people you choose through targeting that is what you will always choose people you choose through targeting unless if it is a if you already have a, a custom audience or, or that you want the people that are in that audience to also be the same persons that you want to reach with this new product otherwise target so we come here edit click the edit button it is to edit the audience now who we are here promoting um marble iphone case so who are the people who are likely to buy this you think you'll be thinking now of uh, who are the people using iphones where are they both men and women use iphone so i would select this all but then which age brackets are most likely to be using iphone well that is where the problem comes anyone can use iphone but because it is a high-end phone i would rather go for say per age say 23 to 55 23 to 55 that is my age range where are they found where are they located well i will choose all the country as in the country all over no but i will not do that i would rather focus maybe on the capitals yes the capital states but which may also be difficult but so i will start my trial with 
um, Lagos Lagos State Nigeria also I've also select Portacourt then Abuja Abuja the Federal Capital Territory let me begin with these three states or I can add worry Delta states and as well as uh, as well as um, can as well add um, Uyu Uyu the capital of Akwaibum states I may add a case to Okay, let me leave it as this first. And each of them now, there is a kind of a um, plus 25 minus within. So let me go this far. This is the audience that I have um, selected. And not everybody there. I will simply look out for the people who use iPhone. If I check if the number is not much, okay, because I'm just targeting people with iPhone only. Let me use the who, um, let me simply say Nigeria. Uh, let me simply say Nigeria. Nigeria. Mm -hmm. So everybody now within that age using is included now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, I will not just end there. I will now go back and look at uh, who are the people that I should target. This is an iPhone case. So who do I target? It's e this one is easier to target. I will go for people using iPhone. iPhone. People who are interested in iPhone. But I wouldn't stop there. I will go further. Hmm. I'll go for the iPhone iPhone people who are interested in using iPhone did I put I do I have a case for iPhone 5 no so I have from iPhone 6 I'll go for people using iPhone 6 iPhone 6s iPhone 6s iPhone 6s iPhone 6s plus then iPhone 7 iPhone 7 iPhone 7 and then iPhone 7 plus iPhone 7 plus iPhone 7 plus iPhone 8 iPhone 8 iPhone 8, what is this one again now? iPhone 8. Mm -hmm. So, iPhone iPhone X, iPhone, I just put all the iPhones as the interest. Okay, that is what I will do. Mm. Not on to browse demographics. Okay, this one is suggestion. You can sometimes you check suggestions mm, because uh, when one supposed iPhone, it will now give you suggestions of all those other ones mm, of the type of things you need. You see them all here iPhone 6, iPhone, all those things, and from the suggestions. You can also browse for interest. Just look at the uh, interest. See business and industry. Look at people that are a certain class of people. Mm. 
um, interest or maybe or I'll go for the behavior first people's behavior um, behavior mm -hmm. I will look at people that are really um, mobile device user mm -hmm. I'll get them See, Android 360 you just check true okay I don't see any one of the behavior I need there sometimes the behavior could be people who are you who you already know that are interested in buying high-end stuff you know if someone that you bought iPhone for may not be able to pay for the product that you want to sell to him you see but if you announce looking at uh, people that are already buying uh, something of high end it will really help you in getting all these things done it will help in getting it done so you you certainly look at for the um, the consumer classification what type of things do they really need okay this one is talking about the country so you check you just have to check the the, the characteristics uh, what type of thing are they buying so such thing now could help you in making the uh, selecting the audience that you really want to use now that you have selected the or you've selected the audience you proceed in other things oh it doesn't seem flex okay i click x instead of clicking the let's go back to the audience you look as i said men and women within that fall within the ranges of uh, 23 and uh, 55 okay that live in nigeria okay using iPhone mm -hmm. okay now check the um, okay check suggestions see iPhone lovers Check iPhone lovers. Okay, iPhone accessories. Mm -hmm. iPhone fans. iPhones. Come again here. I type iPhone 7. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. So you get all those things together as in you pick your audience properly so that it will really reflect exactly what you are doing so you now see at the end you have potential reach of about 920,000 people be more specific type something like iPhone say iPhone 6s iPhone seven. Seven. Mm -hmm. When you go back to the suggestions, you see more iPhone seven plus, iPhone six plus, um. You see different things there. Mm -hmm. So, when you have selected the audience properly, just as what you want, you go down here. See, there are about potential reach of 950,000 persons using this. Click save. Mm -hmm. So, you have that audience now save to your ad you proceed 
The next is uh, to budget your budget and the duration of the advertisement. Budget and duration. So, how much do you want to budget for the advert? How much do you have? How many persons do you reach? Like here, now it says that you have a with six thousand hundred and thirty thousand naira, you'll be able to reach eight thousand nine hundred to thirty nine thousand people of the nine hundred and fifty thousand persons that you have. So let us say that you want you have a budget of four thousand naira for the advertisement. Say so four thousand naira. Okay, so this is a four thousand naira or oh. something is having problem here. Okay, so four thousand naira. Don't mind this in here because because of uh, I have less than this on the account, so that is why it's showing. So with four thousand naira, you have an estimated reach of six thousand three hundred to twenty-seven thousand persons per day. That is per day okay so in how long do you want it to run just one day of how long do you want the um, the advert to run you you can select seven days mm -hmm. so if it is seven days you spend an average of 571 naira per day this ad will run for seven days and then on 7 June you see so if you really want to make it small you can add more to the budget you can say okay but you want to say um and now you see the hotel has reduced to 890 to 3600 people per day so you can make it say 7000 naira the entire budget so that you'll be able to reach larger number of persons that is the estimated reach sometimes it goes more than that then payment say here available balance is this but it doesn't matter then the, the, this one is a pixel for the tracking tracking conversions if you really have a website that is when you now make use of this pixel but if you don't have the never bother it doesn't matter so you have simply um you are done with the boosting everything is completed everything is completed so what is next all you now need to do is uh, to click boost to click boost and off it goes but before you click the boost check the appearance of it the appearance of um the um what you've created you see there is desktop feed desktop news feed and as well as a mobile news feed what are they all about for the this is how it will appear if someone is viewing it on the desktop but if someone is viewing it on the mobile news feed this is how it will be it's a stylish mobile iphone case i just two new photos iphone blah 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 then the same here so whichever they are following whichever way they are viewing it or whatever device they are using to view it this is how it will be so what again the um, boosting is completed you click boost mm -hmm. when you have uh, say we, we've received your order we are reviewing your ad to make sure that it meets our advertising policies this usually takes less than 15 minutes so in less than 15 minutes this will start showing to people so that is about the boosting that's about uh, what can happen to it and it's running now it's running so that is it That is about um, boosting your page. The next we will look at now is uh, creating advert on its own, not just on boosting already posted uh, stuff, but to create a new advert altogether, not using a um, a post, not boosting a page, a post on the a page. That is what we will do in the next video.
so the status of the okay so all you now need is a UV checking when once it is a uh, and once they finish review, they will send you. They will send you a what is it called message that your advert is running, and it will be running. That is it. You now be looking out for those um, taking action for the advert. So, like I said, next will be on creating complete advertisement on without using a posted. Uh, article or posted post you see even before we even this it's your post your boosted post has been approved so the advert is running now it has been approved it's running now so quick <laughs> okay i will just cancel it i mean i'm still here i've not gone anywhere they sent the message good news your your, your boosted post for iphone users <laughs> blah, blah 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 okay okay this has been approved view boosted uh, post i'm not viewing anything view more promotions but I'm not viewing them, even though they have been approved. That is just how they will be for now. Mm.